Hey, what's up guys? I've got a quick uh, Steelbook unboxing here for you. As you can see, this is the Best Buy exclusive 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray digital copy version of Ford v. Ferrari. Um, I like the Steelbook, the look of it. Uh, I actually, I almost didn't buy this because I'm, I don't know, the, the film itself didn't look interesting to me, but I, I remember when I first heard about it like a year or so ago, I just... I don't know, it didn't sound right to me, but I've seen, you know, trailers and stuff since then, and obviously Damon and Christian Bale are in it, and I thought, that could be good, I don't know. And the Steelbook looked nice, so I figured, what the hell, it's been getting a lot of praise, you know, I haven't seen it yet, you know, but it's, I think it was actually up for an Academy Award for Best Picture, which was, uh, the, the Academy Awards were just this last weekend, and uh, Parasite won, which was nice, but uh, I think this was up for Best Picture, wasn't it? Um, well, anyway, I'm rambling, but uh, I figured I'd get the Steelbook. Um, so here it is. I haven't seen it. Um, they didn't, when I picked this up, I had, I did it for, um, in-store pickup at my Best Buy. And, uh, I looked around, I just kind of glanced around, and they did not have any of our steel books available. So I'm glad I pre-ordered. I haven't just gone in on the same day in a long time. But, um, anyway, I don't know, I'm, I'm not even going to talk about it. It looks like a good film. I'll check it out. I like Christian Bale. There's kind of, I thought there might be a little dent right there. It's a very small dent, though, so... Like I said, though, there weren't any more in store anyway, so I can't really replace it. Let's get the glue off of there. Just two pieces of glue. Which is pretty typical, I guess. And this was... Um, 20th Century Fox, which is going to be called 20th Century Studios in the future, because they were acquired by Disney, of course. Can you see that? There's a ding up there, which is fucking lame, but you know, whatever, I guess. That was covered up by the thing, actually, so you wouldn't have seen it anyway, but, uh, it's shiny. Actually, there's a couple dings on here. Steelbook game is starting to piss me off. So easy to ding these. They're so. Whatever. How's the back look? I think it looks okay. Uh, no spine slash that I can see, so. Okay. It's not fingerprint either, so it's okay. There's my digital code, and then here is the. Okay. And then the Blu ray. And there's Matt Damon and uh, Christian Bale. The story is based on a true story uh, uh, when uh, Ford and uh, Ferrari, the Italian company, were having like a friendly game of a competition of uh, during the Le Mans, I think, classic or whatever it was. I, I forget what exactly the story is. Like I said, I haven't seen a film and I don't know the story fully, but I know that um, it's how they made the Mustang or the, how they created the Mustang. They're trying to have something that competes with them, Ferrari. I guess I could be wrong there too, but that's my understanding. Maybe I'm wrong. But uh, www.foxmovies.com. Hmm. I know there's actually art on the disc. That's cool. I feel like that's kind of rare now with um, um, Blu-rays and 4Ks and stuff, but that's cool. This is going to bother me though. This is stupid. Yeah. It shouldn't bother me though. It's not going to bother me. Blah, 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 blah. But I do like that image. Just let me do it back here, too. Did I show you this? Yeah. 66. In fact, I think it was called, in, in the UK and whatnot, I think it was called um, uh, Le Mans 66, I think. Very cool. Let me take a look at the special features and whatnot. Let's see. Well, let's do a synopsis real quick. You can read that if you want. Like I said, there's the um, description. Yeah, I'm creating the world's fastest car in comparison to um, uh, Ferrari. Yeah, Le Mans in France. Yep. Uh, special features. Looks like it's just one. Well, it's an eight-part documentary, but it's just one feature. Bringing the rivalry to life. Eight-part making a documentary. Cool, cool. This was directed by James Mangold, who directed 
um, Logan, I believe, and other things. Um, is this based on a book? I don't think so. Written by Jez Butterworth and John Henry Butterworth and Jason Keller. Okay, the Butterworth family. Yeah. So that's Jess Lucas. Carolina Belfi. John Bernthal, of course. He's always in a lot of cool stuff. He's that's the Punisher. And Shane from The Walking Dead from a thousand years ago. So yeah, that's it. Very cool. Well, yeah, whatever. Thanks for watching, guys. Like I said, I can't talk about the film exactly because I haven't seen it, but I'm expecting it to be pretty good because it's Christian Bale, and he doesn't typically do bad films, but, you know. So, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, uh, I don't know what else is coming. Uh, yeah, I don't know anything off the top of my head. There's stuff coming, I'm sure. More Steelbooks, more uh, horror stuff coming out. Hopefully more um, Arrow and Screen Factory and whatnot. But, you know, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you again in a little bit, probably, so uh, I'll talk to you later. Bye.